Hello, everybody. Uh, welcome to Lua in Moscow event uh, 2017. Uh, here we have Alexander Gladysh, uh, logic editor. The company is the, is the, it's the name of the company and uh, the main organizer of this event. Uh, and uh, then we have uh, Igor Erlich. 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 Igor Erlich uh, from IP on Web and uh, Anton Soldatov also from IP on Web and uh, yours truly, Kostya Osipa from uh, Mail.ru uh, hosting this event. And uh, uh, we are going to discuss uh, how the event is, com is going. And uh, my first question is to Alexander. Uh, how difficult was it to get everybody here, organize the event, and uh, get the thing running? Uh, not as difficult as the workshop in 2014. But it I had to change a few persons. So it wasn't uh, as difficult. So what was the, the most complicated thing, getting the people over from uh, uh, you know from abroad or something else the price on the tickets oh. from abroad is is a bit it's steep. not not it was it's a, it's a surprise okay uh, what happens to the airplane prices but other than that uh, the main uh, thing is to get the people going to pull actual abstracts from speakers okay. and uh, yeah. to, to, to fill the schedule with good talks. Uh, and uh, I have a question to IP on web people. Uh, why do you think this event is important? Why are you here? And uh, why did you agree to sponsor it? This event is uh, very special for us because uh, due to the nature of our industry, our tech industry, it's very closed. And uh, as an engineering force, we are unfortunately rather closed as well. And uh, events such as this uh, allow us to meet people who do stuff uh, similar to what we do. And to talk to them and to collaborate and to, I don't know, just to meet each other. So do you like the event so far? Uh, yeah, sure. It's uh, I, th I think it's going pr pretty good. V very well. So talks are really impressive. And it's nice to meet people in person and communicate. So I have another question to you. Uh, since uh, you were the guys uh, presenting here uh, your own Lua implementation, uh, how is the collaboration within Lua community going? How do you take it? And uh, does this event help to d get c the collaboration going? Yes, of course. I think that uh, Anton will talk uh, elaborate a little bit more. But from what I can see, uh, people want to talk. People want to talk, they want to discuss uh, even such complicated things as uh, new implementations and new approaches, maybe some proposals to the language. They are striving to discuss their vision. And uh, like I said, events such as this uh, allows them to do that. And that's very great for us. Yeah, it's truly great. And uh, this, uh, this event surely helps uh, pushing things forward because well we see lo lo lots of interest in this topic and I really think that should be more and more meeting and discussion on such topics because uh, well sometimes it may uh, seem that a community is too fragmented so such events they do help bring uh, all, all participants all potentially interested parties together. So Alexander what do you think uh how can we grow uh, the number of Lua developers in Russia? I think the first and foremost is the community growth. We are trying to foster the community, we are trying to organize events, but clearly, clearly the interest that they are getting shows that we are not doing enough of that. We have to have more meetups, more conferences. I hope that it would be possible to make this conference year an yearly event. Annual event, uh, great. So, um. also I can say that I've uh, seen uh, announcements of this conference, and I am very glad to see that unlike like two years before uh, in the uh, two thousand. 14. Uh, 14 it was, yes, uh, when we held similar conference. But uh, in this year, I've been looking at the announcements and I've seen people commenting that they, like, I'd like to come and, I really uh, and I'd really like to watch uh, an online uh, 
how can you call it? Online translation? On, 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 online translation, yeah, lay feet from the conference because uh, we'd really like to be there and we'd really like uh, such event to be organized uh, at uh, our location. Yeah, online translation is great. I had five people today asking me about it and about whether the recording is going to be available and things like that. I have a question for you, Kostya, then. Um, why do you feel the mail are you and you as a head of the Toronto, uh, you, Viv Lua and Viv host helping us host the event today. Uh, thanks for the question. I, the, we hosted uh, an event in 2014 and uh, uh, this year we thought it's going to be as important and uh, I even had an entire session devoted wha about why it is important to us today. So. Uh, in a nutshell, uh, we are a big Lua users uh, with Toronto, and uh, we depend on uh, Lua growth a lot. Uh, uh, we depend on this being a good instrument uh, for our developers. So uh, we are ready to invest more and more in actually in the Lua language and uh, coming to the Lua, I would say, challenges. We are willing to contribute patches and, uh, you know, uh, participate in the community in a more broad way. Okay, okay, thank you for the interview. And uh, now we are preparing for the second uh, part of the day uh, with more talks coming. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you.